100 degree weather can leave many people running for the AC, but not your local sanitation workers. I'm your neighborhood reporter Brady Kasky in the North End, riding along with the crews that are picking up your trash, even in extreme heat. It's hot. It's, it's tough. You know, we're out here all day long. You might see James Jackson driving a garbage truck through your neighborhood, collecting your trash. It's over 100 degrees. On the back of the truck, it's, it's the same temperature as it is outside. Uh, inside, it actually gets hotter. It does heat up pretty good. It can get up to 120 in here, I would say. Jared Jensen works at Republic Services with James in a two-man crew. One of them drives the truck while the other rides on the back, dumping trash cans. He tells me that the AC in these trucks has a hard time keeping up with extreme heat. It's hotter than outside. You know, this puts off a lot of heat in here. The engine's right underneath this, so, you know, it gets hot in these trucks. There's no doubt about it. The two swap rolls every hour so that they can take a break from the heat. It definitely adds a little something when you're out here, you know, lifting heavy cans. It's dangerous to a certain point, right? When it gets super hot out there, um, it, it can be dangerous. General Manager Cord Stanley tells me they're adjusting their schedules for the next few weeks to help drivers avoid the worst of the heat. They can complete the bulk of their day early in the morning. Um, and so that they're less exposed at the, at the peak heat of the day, which today is going to be 107, 108 degrees. It, it's obviously beneficial for them. As for James, the heat doesn't stop him from enjoying his favorite part of the job. Being out in the community and just taking care of the customers. Republic Services tells me the best thing you can do to help these guys out is to put your trash cans on the curb the night before trash day. Try to put them in a shady spot if you can, and it never hurts to offer a cold drink on a hot day. Reporting in the North End, I'm your neighborhood reporter Brady Kasky for Idaho News 6.